So over the holiday, and, and I got it both pieces on a discount. So for the Steam Deck, now this mm. only applies to the older non OLED Steam Deck, but I got replacement front panel. Mm. You'll notice the glowing mm. RGBs. That's pretty. The RGBs are actually from the back replacement. Whoa. Zooms have been so, pretty great on, the, on that. Zoom actually. Zoom. It, it, the interesting thing, it was quite the learning experience taking apart Steam Deck. Mm. I will say replacing the back of the Steam Deck is a, if it takes you 15 minutes, it probably took you seven minutes too long. It's literally like four screws, take it off. Wait, uh, two, three, four, five, six, eight screws, pull it off, put the new one on, put the eight screws back in. The front, on the other hand, I would not recommend it if you haven't taken stuff apart before. You do have a step-by-step -step video on how to replace it, but it includes use heating up the L the LCD screen. <laughs> I'm and out. And using like credit card type device to pry it to break up the glue to get it off. No, no glue no strip replacement. Sponger or whatever that call it's called. Whenever you do uh, stuff at iFixit for Apple devices, sponger. Yeah, they give you the, oh, they give you the suction cup. They give you. I, I will tell you this. It's a forty-ish minute, I think, video mm -hmm. for the front panel replacement. It is 110% step-by-step. It is attaching ribbon cables. There's the suction cup there. If you go back to that picture of the all the stuff that comes with it, yeah. they give you all the screwdrivers. They give you the tweezers. They give you everything you would possibly need. And the cool thing that they actually give you is they give you a tray for all of the parts to go in as you're taking it apart. Mm -hmm. And they give you all of the replacement screws. So you actually don't need to keep track of Anything that you're taking out from a screw perspective. Um, you could throw it away I, and that's okay. You could throw it away. You can drop it on the floor and lose it, whatever. And they walk you through and everything's labeled. The kit is very, very good. It's the make sure if you're going to do this and you've never done this kind of stuff before, how you lift a little thing to get ribbon cables out or how you pry off certain pieces of, of tech. If you've done anything like replace a video card in a computer or install a new hard drive, mm -hmm. you're going to be okay. Mm -hmm. But go slow and watch the video. I like it. Um, I would say the and the hardest part for me or the most fearful part for me was prying off the, the LCD screen. Crap out of me. That scares the absolute crap out of me. So this is uh, looks like it's two parts, right? You have a $30 front piece and you have a Thirty-five dollar uh, back piece to this, right? With the LEDs that you were talking about. On the front, the, the front comes in clear brown, clear crystal, or purple, and the Ooh. back in the RGB variant comes in purple, clear, and brown as well. So you can you got to so. mix and match, and uh, however you'd like to there uh, the, for the situation. The cool thing about the the back panel with the RGB lights is it has its own battery and its own USB C port in the back. 